Hello brothers and sisters, Brother John here and I want to share with you what I'm seeing right now. According to the Torah calendar, the creation week was on the year 3979 BC and the third day of creation was on June 11th of the year 3979 BC. So I did the calculations and on June 11th of this year is going to be exactly 6,000 years from the third day of creation. Now I don't know how the Torah calendar figured all these dates out, but if they're correct then this is huge. This would mean that we are entering into the third day after 2,000 years. And if you remember Hosea's prophecy, it says that after two days we will live in the Lord's sight. After two days is the third day. And also the third day is prophesied many times throughout the scriptures as the day that the Lord is going to return. And I mean so many times. Just to give a few examples, in John chapter 2 verse 1, it says, And the third day there was a marriage in Cana of Galilee. The third day is our wedding day. Okay, that's a prophecy there in John chapter 2 verse 1. Also in Exodus chapter 19 verse 11 it says, And be ready against the third day, for the third day the Lord will come down in the sight of all the people upon Mount Sinai. Here we're told to be ready on the third day because the Lord is going to descend from heaven on the third day. Does that sound familiar to you? With the voice of the archangel perhaps? And lastly, we know that the Lord has declared the end from the beginning and from ancient times the things that are not yet done. The prophecy of the third day of creation says, And God said, Let the waters under the heaven be gathered together onto one place. In this prophecy here, we're seeing the gathering together of the church. This is the rapture, folks. The waters are symbolic for the spirit and the spirits are being gathered onto Christ Jesus our Lord on the third day. And we know this because Jesus likens his coming in the Gospels to us being gathered to his body at his coming. And also Paul said in 2 Thessalonians chapter 2 verse 1, Now we beseech you, brethren, by the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ and by our gathering together unto him. Even Paul confirms that we will be gathered to Christ at his coming. Also in Esther, Esther puts on her royal apparel on the third day, which is another prophecy. And I'll go ahead and I'll read it. It says, now it came to pass on the third day that Esther put on her royal apparel and stood in the inner court of the king's house over against the king's house and the king sat upon his royal throne in the royal house over against the gate of the house. This, this sounds like us, the church, putting on Christ's righteous robe, his royal apparel and being brought into the king's house on the third day. What's even more exciting is that June 11th is the one year anniversary of the sign of Jonah. A man named Michael, whose name means who is like God, was swallowed by a whale for 30 seconds and the whale spit him out alive on June 11th of the year 2021. Perhaps this could have been a one year warning sign. We know the sign of Jonah was the resurrection that happened on the third day. And June 11th is exactly 6,000 years from the third day of creation. I don't think this is a coincidence, folks. That means that June 11th is also the third day of creation after 6,000 years according to the Torah calendar. Yeah.